Hey guys, today I'm going to show you executive function superpowers. Now let's start with the book size. It's roughly, I'd say an eight and a half by five and a half type size. It's got a nice soft touch matte finish to the cover and the back. Now what is executive functioning superpowers? Well, let me just read it straight off the back of the book for you so that I don't mess up what it is. You'll discover the vital skills children and teenagers need to succeed in their daily lives and to recognize any skills deficit. You'll be given the strategies and tools to improve their executive functioning skills to help them live their lives with less stress and increased independence. So I just wanted to read that to get the wording correct. Um, so it is a great book. It really does have a lot of great information in it. Now, if we look inside, here's the layout of the book. It is laid out very well for you to be able to read the book. Uh, and then on like page 10 here, it's symptoms of executive dysfunction in your child. These are great places to find information that you need. Um, let's see, chapter one is, it's just a phase. Chapter two, see what you're working with. Chapter three, creating a conducive environment. Chapter four, providing support for the child. Chapter five is so helpful, self-control and regulation. Chapter six, get focused. Chapter seven, time management. Chapter eight, self-monitoring and the road to independence. That is huge. Chapter nine is also huge, dealing with transitions because transitions can be hard, it really can be. So the dealing with transitions chapter is great. Chapter 10, dealing with frustrations, another fantastic chapter. And then chapter 11 is helpful resources. And then there's an appendix with some apps and other useful tools. Overall, guys, this is a fantastic book. I highly recommend it. I hope this review is helpful for you to decide if this book is the right book for you.